Kahala, Yahweh, by Hashem, Yahweh Shai, by Hashem, Rakal Kadash, Barakata Yahweh, Barakata Yahweh Shai, Barakata Yahweh, Barakata Yahweh Shai, Barakata Yahweh, Barakata Yahweh Shai, Kahalayim, Yahweh, by Hashem, Yahweh Shai, by Hashem, Rakal Kadash, double honest to the apostle elders, a great millstone, rule well and tell me this truth. Peace and salutations to the house of David, the elect man pushing his truth and faith and sincerity. Yahweh by Hashem, Yahweh Shai, by Hashem, Rakal Kadash, Barakatham, to all you sincere listeners who may hear this. All right. And um, I don't really have uh, too many scriptures, you know, and that's not, I'm not going to make this too long through the spirit of the prophet by Hashem, Yahweh Shai. You know, I just wanted to go into Revelations 12 and 10 through, through 11, you know, because, um, as as a man of the Lord, man, you shouldn't be uh, in this place like, oh, I'm cool, I'm happy, you know, I'm just okay with with uh, with with life, you know, you you're not really too worried about nothing, man. Are you just chilling, man? Like hell, no, you should be in a position to where you like, man. Fuck this place, man. I hate this place. Everything about it, you know, because I, I hate the fuck out this place, man. All right, the people here, I, they disgust me. All right, I hate these people. They're nothing but fucking demons, reprobates, all right, sottish idiots, all right. Like, I, I just get tired of these people. I get tired of the policies, the laws, how this place is set up. All right, everything about this place is demonic, all right, and, and, and it's what's, what's not to hate about here, man. All right, we're, we're in the, 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 the shadow of death, all right, that King David spoke about in Psalms 23. We actually living in this shit here in America. All right, a cesspool of wickedness, man. All right, a, a complete polluted, defiled place we living in, man. All right, and, and around nothing but sick, defiled, perverse people, man. All right, that's 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 what we living in, man. All right, what what the hell would you would you love this place for, man? I don't love nothing about this shit. All right, getting up and going to work, going to fucking work, paying fucking bills. All right. Just, just dealing with all type of bullshit and madness. All right, who, 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 who would be happy here, man? All right, and and, and these people not ha happy here, man. But if your ass is happy here and you want to go on here, you you scared of death and you 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 love your life and you know you all that bullshit, man. All right, you gonna you gonna fucking die. All right, you gonna die right along with everything else in this place, man. All right, this revelations. Chapter 12, verse 10. I heard a loud voice saying in heaven, now has come salvation. Yeah, now has come salvation right now, man. All right. Salvation being saved from this fucking hellhole, man. All right. Because we need salvation out of this bitch, man. All right. And strength in the kingdom of our power, Yahweh, and the power of his anointed, Hamashiach, Yahweh Shai. For the accuser of our brethren is cast down. Who the hell is our, the accuser of our brethren, man? All right. Esau Edom, the so-called white man. If you don't believe that, then they just just die, okay? Which accused them before our power, Yahweh, day and night. Yeah, which accused us before our power, Yahweh, day and night. This is what this damn devil does, man. All right, and what woe to you who uh, who uh, who write? Uh, let's get it. Let's just get it real quick, just to further elaborate on that real quick. All right. So you think I'm just making something up? All right. This uh Isaiah chapter 10 verse 1. Woe unto thee that them that decry the salaki that decree unrighteous decrees and that write grievousness which they have prescribed. Yeah, so so they so they decree unrighteous decrees, all right, unlawful as laws, okay, implement unlawful as uh devices, all right, plots, you know, schemes, all right, and then they write grievousness. For which they have prescribed, man. So they put that like 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 prime example. Okay, you the, the CIA funnel all this dope over here. Okay, and then then you uh you uh put it in in, in community with Jake. Are you put it around Jake? Okay, then you 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 make sure he ain't got nothing. He completely poor and fucked up. All right, then you make the prison prison industrial complex. You get caught with a little fucking crack rock. Your ass got to do 10, 15, 20 years, man. All right, that's right in grievousness for which they have prescribed, man. All right. To turn aside the needy from judgment and to take away the right from the poor of my people, that widows may be their prey and that they may rob the fatherless. And that's what they do because we fatherless, man. All right. 
That's what, that's, that's what the hell they do, man. All right, the accuser of our brethren. All right, let's get this in Revelation back in Revelation 12. All right, that's so so that alone should piss you off, man. All right, you got these people trying to uh, accuse us before our power day and night, man. All right, and, and, and they were lay nothing but snares and traps and, and, and pits for you, man. All right, so you can fall in it. All right, and be destroyed. All right, biological warfare, okay? Psych psychological warfare, okay? Nothing but per perverseness, all right? And they, and they force it upon you, man. And then uh, when, when you slip into one of their traps, they say, well, look what he did, all right? Like you didn't set the trap up for you, all right? That's, that's hell, man, all right? That's, and that's all America is, full of fucking death, traps, and snares, man, all right? This is Revelation chapter 12, verse 11. And they overcame him by the blood of the Lamb. So that's the only way we're going to overcome the accuser of our brethren, this so-called white man, this damn devil. All right, it's by the blood of the lamb. Who, 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 what, what, what lamb, man? All right, talking about the lamb, the, the, the uh, sacrificial lamb, our Lord, Yahweh Shai. All right, and by the word of their testimony, yeah, the spirit of prophecy. All right, by, by the word of their testimony, when we go out there and speak, all right, in great boldness before the face of our enemies, with wisdom of Solomon in the fifth chapter. All right, when we go out there and let our testicles hang, okay, that's, 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 that's how we're going to overcome these devils. All right. And they love their, not their lives unto death. And that's the key right there. They love not their lives unto death, man. All right. Not not loving this place. Not being uh, in, in tune with this place, man. All right. That's, 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 uh, that's, that's, that's the keys to us to overcome all this wickedness and this death, man. You can't love this shit. shit all right. Because it, it, if you do, all right, you, 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 you just okay. All right, let's, you, you okay with what's going on. If, if, if you, if you're not hating your life. All right, you okay with your life? All right. Let me see. Haven't pulled this one out in a minute. Let's see. Wait. Yeah, here you go right here. Call law, y'all. I see my shot. This uh, Psalm chapter sixty-two, verse ten. Trust not in oppression. Yeah, so you're supposed to be trusting in oppression, man. All right, and this, this, this America, this whole world. All right. The, all, all these, because all these nations have drunk of the philosophy and the fornication of the wine of uh, of of America, man, and, and, and wickedness. Okay, it says, it says, trust not in oppression and become not vain in robbery. All right, and become not vain in robbery, man. All right, if riches increase, set not your heart upon them, man. All right, and that's what our people do, man. They said they 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 uh. They 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 uh they they set their mind upon the riches of this world, man. The things of this world, man. They ain't setting their mind upon you. How about you, Shah? All right, this shit don't mean nothing. All right, all 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 this all this shit that's in this uh world don't mean a damn thing, man. All right, don't mean a damn thing. So why would why the hell would you set your mind upon this shit? You supposed to hate everything about this world, I, I, including riches, man. Are you not supposed to trust in the prison in, in, in this whole world is set up of oppression? All right. Let's get first John. This shit, this shit just is, is vexing, man. To be here every day. It's just vexing. All right. This world is sick and demonic, man. All right. This is uh first John chapter four, verse four. Or is it Salakia? Salakia, that's not the one I want. Bear with me. Maybe second time. Oh, it's James. Salakia. It's James chapter 4, verse 4. Yeah, adulterers and adulteresses. Know ye not that the friendship of the world is enmity with Yahweh? So the friendship of this place is enmity with Yahweh by Shem Yahweh Shah. All right. Being cool with, with, with how this world is set up and everything that goes on in this world, that's that's enmity with Yahweh by Shem Yahweh Shah. He's not, he, he's not, he's not, uh, he's against friendship of this world, man. You're supposed to be loving not your life unto death, man. Your life in this place is, is sick. All right. You weren't put here to be having fun and chilling and shit, man. All right. We, we was brought we 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 are in an oppressive state. We're in captivity, man. All right. 
It says, Yea, adulterers and adulteresses, know ye not that the friendship of the world is enmity with Yahweh? Whosoever therefore will be a friend of the world is a in, is the enemy of Yahweh. There you go. So if your ass is 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 uh in this damn world, okay, cool with the way things are going on in this world, you loving this damn world, your ass is is is, is an enemy of Yahweh by Shah, man. Are you opposition you 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 adversarial to Yahweh by Shimel Shah, man? Are you a Satanist, man? All right, because this place is, this world is completely satanic. All right. Let me get a couple more. I'm going to wrap it up. Wrap it up. I just wanted to get a quick one in. All right. Sus. Ecclesiastes 7 and 7. Yeah, this Ecclesiastic is chapter 7, verse 7. Surely oppression maketh a wise man mad. And a gift destroyeth the heart. So look, man. Surely a prison make up a wise man, man. All right, if your ass was wise, wise you'd be pissed off, man, because we're oppressed. All right? We're oppressed here, man. All right? We're oppressed under a satanic, demonic rulership, man. We're in a fucking sick, sadistic, polluted, demonic world We're around nothing but demons. Why the hell would you not be pissed? All right, why, why would you not be mad? All right, why would you not hate your life? What 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 is there to love about this place, man? All right, let's get this. Let me wrap it up right here, man. Jeremiah fifty-one. This is Jeremiah chapter fifty-one, verse six. Flee out of the midst of Babylon. That don't mean get in a damn plane, go get a passport, and go to a uh, damn uh, go go try to get go into another country, man. All right. Oh, I'm a, I'm a move to Dubai. I'm a, I'm a, I'm a move to West Africa. All right. I'm a, I'm a move to Europe. I'm a move to France. Shut your dumb ass up, man. All right. Flee out of the midst of Babylon, man, and deliver every man his soul. Yeah, and deliver your soul, man. That means spiritually flee out of it. All right. That's how you deliver your spirit, man. All right. You 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 try to go. It, it tell you in Deuteronomy 32 and 39, no one can deliver out of his hands. So no matter what the hell you do, man, your ass can't deliver your. You can go over there. Uh, to, to another country just to die Okay It says be not cut off in her iniquity Yeah cause this place The iniquity of this place is reached up into the heavens Alright It says for this is the time of the Lord Yahabashim Yahashah's vengeance Yeah Yahabashim Yahashah's finna bring vengeance on this place Why cause this place is completely demonic So why in the hell would you love this place Why would you like this place Why would you be okay with it Alright He will render unto her a recompense man If your ass is 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 uh is if your ass is is loving this place and cool with this place, then guess what? You're gonna get caught up in that recompense, man. Alright. But this this was it, man. You know, I ain't I ain't really had too much, you know. I wanna uh give our praise to Yahweh by Shem, Yahweh Shah by Shem Kakadash. Double honor to the apostle and elders of Great Millstone, rule well. Peace and salutations to the house of David. Shalom to the elect.